Hello everyone, I am your host Ayushi Kara Setia and welcome back to our channel Pabli. In this video we are going to learn how you can send Microsoft Outlook email to Discord channel automatically. So let's take an example that you are a business owner who is selling some products digitally and your customers are contacting you via email for the product related issues and queries. Now you might be receiving various mails in your Outlook. But you want that whenever a customer is sending you a mail related to your product, that specific mail details should be shared with your team on Discord channel so that the team can work upon those emails and the requirement of the customer. But here the problem is that there is no direct connection between your Outlook inbox and Discord channel. So how it is going to happen? So here in this video we have came up with an automation by which we are going to integrate your Outlook inbox with Discord channel automatically and to set up an integration or an automation we will be using a software application that is Pabli Connect. So basically Pabli Connect is an automation and integration software which will help us in integrating both these software applications automatically. The best part here is it doesn't require any coding skills or programming knowledge. Even a non-technical person can use this software application very easily. So how you can set up this automation for that you need to come to my screen. So welcome back to my screen. Here let us type P-A-B-B-L-Y, pabli.com in our browser. This is the website of Pabli. Here we have to come to products and click on Pabli Connect. This is the landing page of Pabli Connect. As you are the first time user, you have to click on sign up for free option. And by clicking on sign up free button, you are going to create your new account in just 2 minutes. And by creating a new account, you are going to get 100 tasks free every month. And if the task expires, 100 free tasks will get credited to your account in the next month. If you are already a user of Pabli Connect, simply click on sign in. In the all apps section, come to Pabli Connect and click on access now. This is the dashboard of Pabli Connect. Here we have to create a workflow. For that, come to this plus sign and click on create workflow. Now here we need to give a name to the workflow. So let us give the name as Microsoft Outlook Emails to Discord Integration. Here you can give the workflow name as per your requirement and simply click on create. Now we can see a trigger window and an action window. So Pabli Connect works on the concept of trigger and action. Trigger means when this happens, action means do this. So in this particular use case, we want to send the channel messages in Discord whenever we receive a new Microsoft Outlook email. So first we have to create an integration between our Outlook account and Pabli Connect so that whenever we receive a mail, automatically the same mail details are captured here in Pabli Connect. So let's open this trigger window and here we are going to choose the application name as email parser. And here we can see a email hook. Okay. He can, here we can read the instructions also. You need to send or forward the email to this email address above and we will fetch all the details from your email. Okay. For that, let's copy this email address from here. Okay. The mail hook I have copied from here and I'll just move to my Outlook account. Okay. So this is my Outlook account and here we can find the settings option. Click on settings and here when we scroll down, we can find view all Outlook settings. So cl simply click on view all Outlook settings and here we can find forwarding option. Click on forwarding and here we can find enable forwarding option. Simply enable the forwarding. Now it is asking forward my email to. So here we have to enter a valid email address. So we will be pasting the email address that we have copied from Pabli Connect, this mail hook address. So let us paste it over here. Okay, now it is asking keep a copy of forwarded messages. So if you want to keep the copy in your inbox, you can select it or else you can just uh, uncheck this particular box. Okay, so I am just keeping the copy of all the mails in my inbox. I have selected it and now let's click on save. Okay, and all the settings are saved now. I'll just click on close. Okay, now whenever we are going to receive a new mail, all the details of the mail will be captured over here. Now it is waiting for the email parser response. Okay, and here we can see the instruction also. Send an email to the mail address mentioned above so that we can capture all the details from the email content automatically. So I am logging from some uh, customer device over here. Okay, this is my customer account. And here I have already drafted a mail. Pabli subscription plan details required. This is the subject line. 
Hello, I am interested in purchasing the paid plan of Pabli Connect. Please share the details and let me know whom to connect in case of any queries. Thanks and regards. And here I have entered the customer name. Okay. Now, whenever I'll send this mail, whenever the mail will be received on my Outlook account, all the details will be captured in Pabli Connect. Let's check it. Let's click on Send. Sending. Message sent. So, the mail has been sent. Let's check the Outlook also. I'm just going to refresh my Outlook account. Okay, the mail is not yet received. Let's refresh it once again. Okay, and here we have got a new mail from the customer. And this is the same mail that we have sent. Now, let's check Pabli Connect also. Okay, and here we can see the responses received. And here we can find all the details related to the mail captured over here. Okay, we can find our email address. This is my Outlook email address. This is the email address of the customer who has sent the mail. This is the customer name. This is the subject line. Okay. And here we have got the body text also. I'll just scroll down. Okay. I'm just searching for the body text. Yes. This was the message that the customer has sent. Okay. Now here we are going to apply a filter because you may be receiving uh, many mails in a regular basis. So how we are going to sort the emails? Because each and every mail will be captured over here in Pabli Connect. But we want to send the channel message on Discord whenever a specific mail is received, okay, which is related to your business or which is related to your uh, product or services, okay. For that, we are going to apply a filter, okay. So let's scroll down, come to this action step and choose the application name as filter over here. Now here we have to select a label. So in the label, I'll be selecting the subject of the mail. So let us find the subject. If the subject and here the filter type will be contains. If the subject contains Pabli word. Okay. If the subject contains Pabli word, then this workflow should run. Now we are applying the or condition or if the subject. So let us select the subject once again. If the subject contains subscription word. Okay. Then this particular workflow should run. Then I, let's apply one more OR condition or if the subject contains pricing word in the mail, in the subject line, then this particular workflow should run. So here I have applied OR conditions. So you can just apply some more OR conditions as per your requirement. So here we have specified three OR conditions. If the subject contains Pabli or if the subject contains subscription or if the subject contains pricing, then this particular workflow should run. Let's check the condition by clicking on save and send test request. Okay, here we have got a status success message condition is true. So why this condition is true? Just because in the subject line, okay, I'll just show you the subject line also. Yes, so this is the subject line here in this particular subject line, Pabli word is there. Okay. We have specified that if the Pabli word is there, then the workflow should run. And even our second condition is also satisfying over here. Okay. In the subject line, even the subscription word is also there. Okay. So here the subscription word is also there. So it is satisfying both the conditions. That is why here we have got the message condition is true. Okay. Now we want to send the channel message on Discord with our team. For that, click on this plus sign add action step. And here let us choose the application name as Discord. Select the action event as send channel message HTML. Click on connect. Now here it is asking for the webhook URL. Enter your webhook URL. Follow these steps to get webhook URL from your Discord account. So let's click on this particular hyperlink. And here we are redirected to Pabli forum. So you can enter the webhook URL over Discord for sending the messages. You can find the webhook URL by following these steps. Okay. So let's move back to Pabli Connect. And I know the steps already. So I'll just take you to my Discord account uh, over here. So this is my Discord account. And here I have already created some servers. Okay. You can find many servers over here. So if you want to create a new server, simply click on this plus sign, add a server. You can create a server as per your requirement. So here we'll be using the server that is Pabli Team. And in this particular server, I have already created some channels. Okay, so this is the channel that it that is Outlook emails we will be using for this particular integration. If you want to create a new channel, simply click on this plus sign create channel. You can select the channel as text or voice as per your requirement. I have selected it as a text. You can give a channel name. 
You can select its, its privacy from here. It's a private channel or a public channel and simply click on create channel and the channel will get created. So simply, okay. I'll just close it. And here we are just uh, moving to Outlook emails. Okay. Now to get the webhook, simply click on this small arrow sign over here and click on server settings. And here we can find integrations option. Click on it. Now here we are going to create a new integration. Okay. For that, click on this webhooks option. And here we'll be creating a new webhook. So simply click on new webhook button. Now it is asking for the name of the webhook. So let us give it as automation. Okay, you can give it as per your requirement. And here we have to select the channel name. So our channel name is Outlook Emails. So I'm selecting the channel name. Okay, now let's click on Save Changes. Here we'll be copying the webhook URL. Okay, and we have to paste the webhook URL over here. Okay, now it is asking for the message. What is the message you want to send your team on your Discord channel? So here let us enter the message as Hello team. new lead received and let us enter the details customer name his email address and the requirement okay so i'm just drafting a message random message you can draft the message as per your requirement let us enter the details over here so we have already got the name email address and the requirement of the customer from the mail response over here from the trigger response so we will be mapping all these details from the trigger response for mapping simply scroll down just click it over here and we have to come to email parser and from here we'll be mapping the customer name in the same way let us map the email address of the customer from email parser this was the email address and here we will be mapping the requirement so i'll be mapping the subject line over here in the requirement okay now here we have to give a bot name so let us give it as new lead okay you can give the bot name as per your requirement and even even you can give the bot icon url over here okay now text to speech you can select it as enable or disable i'm just keeping it as disable and let's click on save and send test request okay and here we can see that we have received a response let's check our discord channel let's close this particular window and here we have got a new message hello team new lead received Name, the customer name is mentioned, the customer email address is mentioned and the requirement is also mentioned as family subscription plan details required. Okay, so a team can work upon this particular message and they can convert the lead into your customer. And in this way, our integration is working fine. Let's move back to Pabli Connect and let us save this workflow first. Data saved successfully. Okay. So as we have set up an automation, this is a one time process. Next time, whenever you, any of your customers sending the mails to your Outlook account, automatically all the mails will be redirected to Public Connect. The mails will be sorted on the based of filter. And if the condition satisfy, your team is going to receive a message on your Discord channel regarding the new lead details. Okay, now let us check this in the real time that whether our integration is actually working fine or not. For that, I'll just move to the email address for, of some other customer. And here I have drafted a, another message. Please share the pricing details. Hi team, I have a paid plan for Public Connect. I am run out of all my tasks for the current month. Please share the pricing details for upgrading it. Thanks. And here I have entered the customer name. Now let's send the mail. Okay. Let's click on send. Sending message sent. So the mail has been sent. First let us check our Outlook account. I'll just refresh it. So here we have got a new mail from the customer. The same mail is received over here. Okay. Now let us check whether our team has received any message on Discord or not. Okay. And here we have got a new message. Hello team. New lead received. Here the customer name is mentioned. His email address is mentioned. And even the requirement is also mentioned. So this condition also satisfies just because in this particular email address we can see the pricing word. Okay. It was mentioned in the subject line. And in this way, we can see that our integration is perfectly working fine. So let's move back to Public Connect and I'll just minimize all these windows and let us see in a nutshell whatever we have done till now. So first we have created an integration between Outlook and Public Connect using email parser. And then we have captured all the details of the email in Public Connect. 
Then we have applied the condition over here using the filters that if the label contains or if the subject line contains pably or subscription word or pricing word, then only this particular workflow should run further. And at last using the details and using the uh, details of the subject line, we have sent a message with a, to our team on Discord channel that a new lead has been received. And in this way, we have created a successful integration between Outlook account and Discord channel using Pabli Connect. So not just these software applications, you can integrate a ton of applications and automate your business using Pabli Connect. In case of any queries, you can visit our Pabli forum. To check the pricing details of Pabli Connect, you can visit this particular URL. Also the link of Pabli Connect and this workflow is available in the description box. You can clone the same workflow into your account directly. If you really like this video, please comment, share and subscribe. Thank you everyone.